at C-SPAN. Jason is next from Vancouver, Washington. Good evening, Jason. Hey, how's it going tonight? I was going to sing Bernie's praises, but I think I'd rather respond to some of these Republicans. Okay, um, go for it. Uh, first of all, you know, I think Bernie's socialism is, is relative. If you stick Bernie in Europe or Canada, he's a fairly mainstream politician. And we need to be thinking, you know, Tommy Douglas, not Chairman Mao. Uh-huh. And as far as where the money is going to come from, I mean, Bernie Sanders has been quite clear. So I think some of these previous callers maybe just haven't looked, looked into him that much. But he proposes a Wall Street transaction tax to pay for university, public university education. Um, switching to a single-payer health care system is cheaper. We know it is. We have empirical evidence from, you know, 50 other industrialized nations that tell us that this is a cheaper system, about half as cheap as the one we're having now and and the bulk of the money is going to come from raising the tax rates and he's been mm-hmm. quite honest of course he hasn't come out with a, a firm number yet but based on what he said and inferred you, you have to think it's going to be somewhere in the the kennedy era neighborhood of in the 60s or something and I, again it's all relative to the rest sure. of the industrialized world if, if you if you look at our tax rates compared to everybody else they're they're ridiculously low and it's and it's, and it's relative to the reagan Jason, just on the line, I want to ask you, because he was in Washington State last week. Did you see him when he campaigned out there last weekend? Oh, I was, I was, in, I was in Finland last week, actually, okay. visiting some friends, so I, I didn't make it. But, uh, you know, it, you stick Bernie in the mid-1950s, and, and he's called a socially liberal Eisenhower Republican. He's really, his, his views are not extreme. It's just extreme in 2015 after we've had 35 years of, you know, this trickle-down economics. Can he win the nomination? Oh, I think I, I think he can. I just didn't, don't see how an honest man is going to be defeated after a public's just been fed platitudes for decades. 